Hello humans. It's been one day since the big baby periwinkle left us. Um, do you think it's still alive? I don't think it is. But it's probably dead. Of course, I can't tell if it's dead or not because I don't know where it is. That's the beauty of losing a periwinkle. And then I'm going to find it like two months later and it's somewhere really stupid. Oh, look, he's moving. What the, what the, what the frick is he trying to accomplish by doing that? Like, what, what message are you trying to send? Except for that, um, you're really stupid. By the way, what if they're using that to escape? No, they can't. It's like there's a barrier. Too bad, you can't be there. Because this thing technically isn't even part of the habitat. But yeah, I'm gonna do... I'm gonna grief the ant colony that clearly is living under here. Well, guess what? There was not an ant colony living under here, but there are ants. I just got a whiff of that smell of death. Okay, um... Yeah, I, I wonder if people's basements smell like this. We, we gotta find where the ants are living because... There can't be ants living so near the periwinkles. Because that counts as invading. I'm gonna put the habitat facing this way. Also, this piece of wood is so broken. What, what if I just don't even use this piece of wood? You know, I. Oh my god. I'm, I'm gonna try doing that. So I, I don't even know why I put that there in the first place. It's just been there for the past like five years. Okay, yeah. Let's get rid of them first. Where are they? Oh, they're they're behind that thingy. Um, that's bad. But yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna try and see if there's any periwinkles in here. Any periwinkles spotted? No. Okay, that's very nice. Man, it's so weird having this thing on the bare wood. And not on that that bare wood. But like that piece of wood is so bent that that thing isn't even on a flat surface. Probably because I flooded that thing with water so many times before. Why is there a caterpillar? Very strange oddities. Okay, um... That thing is sharp. Okay. Now I can't find the ants. Very nice. Yeah, I cannot find the ants. I have no idea where they're going. I'll just search on the other side. Meanwhile, I'm gonna feed the pit of death again, even though I know that all the all the maggots have died a long time ago. <laughs> yeah, by the way, it's been over a week since I got those periwinkles, I just realized. The caterpillar's still alive. Oh 
raw dogging it. Raw dogging. What the frick? Why, why is it so meaty? Like, if I put any pressure, it's gonna explode. Welcome to hell, caterpillar. You're two steps from hell. Where is it? Oh my god, is, is that the- is, oh! Guys, don't put your head directly above it. Not that you could do that. Oh my god, it sm It smells like my basement. It smells like what my basement would smell like. If I had a basement, because I don't. But yeah, is, is, that, is that a cricket? That's the caterpillar. It's still alive. It's it's been in hell for like a few seconds. Yeah, it's probably dead now. You know what? Because I'm merciful, I'm gonna rescue it. Even though it's probably like probably has permanent damage to its body already from being inside of here. Yeah, it's its body is completely stiff and straight. That's what happens to caterpillars when they die. Oh my god. See, I have mercy. I don't completely kill my victims. No, I do. But like, still. I don't completely kill them. I, I only assist in the kill. Because I'm just really nice. But yeah, I'm not touching that again. Like, I, I could touch it before I put it in, but now that it's been inside, I don't want to touch it. Yeah, enjoy your life, caterpillar. Is, is it still alive? I mean, it's moving. It's moving in a very dead looking way um yeah enjoy your time but meanwhile we still have to blow up the ant's base um Where are they? Alright, they're probably under here. Okay. Oh, I see them. They're like all over that place. Yeah. Why? Wh There's even more. What? Man, th these ants have to travel like a whole. a whole whole marathon just to get to their food oh no they're they're right under this block okay, better act fast before they all escape are there ants in there as well okay yeah Gotta grief as much as possible. They're, they're clearly still alive. This is bad. I bet you there's like... When's the last time I touched this thing? Wow. For that that rock I, I used to have that rock in one of my old periwinkle places. What the frick? Th 
It was just a weird like mosquito thingy. Yeah, these guys are screwed. What, why are there more of them? I, I think I'm pretty sure they're all coming. They're all coming back to. Yeah, some of them are hiding over there. Oh my god. What the f. I think I'm probably dumber than the ants. Like. The ants spent so much effort and social networking to build such a big settlement. Like they, they have to be at least like 10 IQ smarter than me. Like I, I could never do such a thing. These guys are infidels. Infidels shall be slaughtered. What am I saying? Yeah, I, th I think I killed enough of them. They they should they probably won't come back to their hideout. Probably won't. There's no way of knowing if they will or not. There you go, about like a hundred insects worth of corpses. And like years of work have just been turned into Turn into dust. It's for the good cause. Okay, we are, we are purifying the nation. We are getting rid of these infidel ants. Where the frick did I put this? There you go, that's good enough. And where do I put this piece of wood? No, I, it's gonna mess up my practical setup. I'll, I'll just continue using it. Don't even care. chair for their whole lives. Rock, rock, rock. I, I, I can give them an earthquake every time. It's pretty convenient actually. I, I haven't counted them yet. One, two, three, four. Dead one. Five, six. Six. What? One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay. So. Yeah, 
I think I'm a very high level elite film editor. is very important. Put the paper clip in because they keep on escaping in this exact place. Put the glove over here so they can't get out from the crack. Um, put this thing over here. So they can't, I don't know, so they can't escape. Actually, I put it the wrong way. Where did the rock go? You know, I'm getting a new rock. Let me put the rock over here. There you go. Completely, completely escape proof. This, this thing does not look very escape proof, actually. I'm gonna use the same glove that I used to kill an ant colony to blockade the wall. It's now it should be escape proof. So yeah, hopefully you enjoyed this 14 minute long video. See you next time. <laughs>